Hey, how are you guys? So I just got home from work and today I want to talk about what's the easiest way to get a job after graduating from college. So let's say you're graduating from college this semester, right? So the first thing that you need to do in order to get a job fast after you graduate from college is you need to have a few internships. You need to have a few recommendation letters from your professors. You need to have reference you need to have people that you have worked with on the past that you can use as a reference and employers are going to call them and they basically going to ask them a few questions about you and your work exit. So if you don't have any reference, just grab any of your friends, family members and put them down as a reference. Make it up that they were your employer, that you used to work with them and just just have them you know like make sure that you guys let them know in what company you guys were working at and the amount of time that you guys work for but to be honest that's something that you might have to do if you really want a job you might have to pick a friend or some of uh, a family member and pretend like they're your reference and give the employer like a good reference you need to give them what they want to hear so do that but it's better if you have a legitimate reference so when you are working at that part-time job make sure you're giving your all it doesn't matter if you're flipping burgers at mcdonald's make sure you're the best burger flipper like out there so that way you can use your manager and your co-workers as a reference you know be nice to them like so that way you can use them as a reference in, in the future so let's say you have that you have your diploma you got your references you have a few internships so the easiest way to get a job is you need to apply to a lot of jobs you need to network you need to talk to a lot of people and you know just don't be afraid to ask them hey listen do you know if they're hiring but don't make yourself look like you're desperate to find a job make it seem like you know like you're a good candidate and that they actually gonna benefit from having you there like like make it seem like you're questioning them like oh how is it like how is it working over there is it a good job like you know make it seem like 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 you're interested but you're not desperate you know make it seem like oh maybe that's a good you know and just ask them like ask everyone do you know if they hiring don't ask them like can you help me get a job like people don't like when you go straight up to them like hey can you help me get a job like no just ask them like hey do you know if they they hiring over there or do you know any companies that are hiring I think I want another job you know like I've been thinking about getting an, a, a new job but I don't know where I'm looking for something that I like so something that I did not know when I while, while I was looking in college is that there's temp agency you can actually go to a temp agency and you sign a contract and there they'll send you to work to different organizations and it could be anything they, they might send you to a company and do different things right so if they like how you work what they'll do is that company will buy your contract from the temp agency so you're gonna end up working for them I didn't want to do the temp agency because once you sign that contract you're gonna have to be with them for like six months or something like that and I didn't really want it to wait that long and you know what happened I actually waited that long to get a job more than six months so just do it go to a temp, temp agency sign a contract it doesn't even matter what you want to do just if, if you're not finding a job if, if you're not able to find a job this month next month go to a temp agency and just do anything take any job that they offer you but make sure that it's like a career you know like something good like something where you can um, get a better position eventually you could you could work in the in, in the uh, as an office assistant and then you can move your way up but don't don't go to work at a kitchen or in maintenance or something something like that don't do that another thing is recruiters you can you can contact a few recruiters a few recruiters agency and you can pay them to find you a job that's another option like paying 200 300 dollars to a recruiter 
to help you find a job where you're gonna make that like within a few weeks like that's worth it so so networking temp agencies recruiters and another thing is applying to a lot of jobs on indeed like i said in my previous video i applied to more than 2500 jobs before i landed the job that i have now so do that and apply to like the small agencies don't apply like to the fortune 500s apply to the small agencies apply to to companies that if you go to their website you can tell that they have an update of that web website and in a, in a long time just apply to like a small agencies and just apply to, to any job like just any job apply to any job don't follow your dreams don't follow your 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 passion if you want a job this is what you have to do just go on indeed and apply to any job so tr try to apply to jobs related to human services social work and you know government agencies and most likely in in your state in your city they have a they have an unemployment agency here in new york it's 9 11 or 3 11 i think it's 9 11 but there's an uh, there's a government agency 9 11 unemployment you go there you sign an application within two months they contact you and they'll help you they'll help you get a job i think it's called an unemployment agency so yeah just apply to unemployment you know and that's the easiest way to to get a job to be honest it, was, it took me two years to get a job because i was focused on getting a corporate job after graduating from college i was only applying to jobs related to corporate and i was applying to good companies as well now don't don't be afraid to to the dental the, the dental office where you get your teeth clean or you check your your teeth don't don't be afraid to apply there don't don't be afraid to apply where where you, where your doctor works i mean in your doctor's office with your primary care provider don't be afraid to apply there like ask your doctor like hey are you guys hiring you know you have to ask everyone like i are, are you guys hiring in order in order to get a job so you might think like oh but i don't have i'm not a nurse i'm not a medical assistant they always have like they always have like office administrator role that's a that's a good place to start you learn skills like how to use excel how to use calendar how to use there's a lot of things that working in an office you're gonna learn that you might not think of like i remember when i started applying working in my job it was like how do i fax like i didn't even know how to fax i was like how do i fax how do i scan how how do i you know how do i communicate with the people from 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 this organization through email so there's a lot that you're gonna learn working in a small doctor's office and in a small dental clinic so this applied to to anywhere like i said so that's the video guys if you like this video make sure to leave a like if you have any questions leave a comment and subscribe to my channel for more videos on career entrepreneurship and cryptocurrency i'll see you on the next one